Hey guys, it's Alma. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in a really, really long time. So I wanted to film like a sit down, let's do like a little Bath and Body Works, what I've used up the past month, month and a half, which I have to say, I've been getting better at like not going crazy using up any of my products. So I've made them last actually a lot longer than I have in the past. I'm super, super excited about that because y'all know everything is so dang expensive these days. But I figured because I haven't seen you guys in so long, I wanted to do just a little bit of makeup. Just make myself feel cute because the past couple weeks have been rough. So I don't have any like crazy amount of stuff to show you guys, but I did have some really good products. So let's just get right into it. First thing I wanted to show you guys is a mahogany teakwood candle. You guys know this is like a prized possession to me. I hold on to these and I literally use them last always because I'm obsessed with this scent. Now, if you're not familiar with mahogany teakwood, it's a very manly scent. Um, it has rich mahogany, black teakwood, dark oak, frosted lavender, and essential oils. This, <laughs> I don't know how else to say it other than this is the way that a man should smell. It smells so freaking good. And the crazy thing about it is some candles, like when you burn them, they smell burnt afterwards, but this one still smells like the actual scent. So... 10 out of 10. I'm super, super sad I used this up, but I'm also, you know what? I think I'm going to hold it, do the whole like depotting thing with the candles. I've done it a couple times, but I want to see if um, with this one, if the scent will still last. Because if you guys aren't familiar, um, when you depot, sometimes the scent just, it burns. I don't know what it is. It, it doesn't smell the same. Um, I've tried a couple of my scents in wax warmers and it, no. No, not even close to what they used to smell like. But I'm going to give this one a 10 out of 10. My favorite. Super, super excited about it. Very, very sad um, that I used it up. But I'm going to be adding more to my collection. Next up, I tried Happy Vibes. Happy Vibes, just the packaging to me is like everything. You know? It's just like a very fun, colorful packaging. I actually really, really like this. It's in... Um, with pink citrus, crisp pear, fresh honeysuckle, sheer vetiver, and dewy orchid. I really like this set, and I still can't put my finger on to what I think it smells like. Other than, like, mandarin. That's literally what it smells like to me. Just very, like, fruity, very fresh, very citrusy. I really, really like this set. I'm going to give this one easy like nine nine and a half out of ten i would definitely repurchase this one so the next set that i use is chasing daydreams i did a shorts on this one as well i believe i think i did happy vibes too i don't remember because i do so many of them but this one it has bright orange zest glowing magnolias and sparkling sun rays this one to me smells like clean laundry fresh linen like it's just a very very soft and subtle scent it's not overpowering at all which is kind of the opposite of what I'm used to because I do like my fruity scents. I also like my masculine scents. This one, I would probably give it like a seven, seven and a half out of 10. Not one of my favorites, but also like, I don't hate it, you know? Like it's very, very simple, perfect for anyone that's really sensitive to different scents. Or if you just want a scent that's like every day, go for it. I definitely suggest you try it. I also use up a champagne toast. Y'all can't tell me this packaging is just not like amazing. I love this new like studded packaging that Bath and Body Works has been using for their body washes. It just looks so cute and like sophisticated to me. This one doesn't have um, what the ingredients are. And truthfully, I can't put my fingers on it because like, I don't know. To me, champagne toast champagne in general just like doesn't really have like a very distinctive scent to me this almost smells like a plumberry or like a oh my gosh like it to me, it kind of reminds me of uh oh my gosh why am I blanking a thousand Christmas wishes I don't know what it is but there's there has to be a keynote that's like very very similar between the two 
and I can't put my finger on it but I really really like champagne toast it's a very like fun scent very fruity to me um I would probably give this one like an eight eight and a half out of ten I would definitely repurchase it because I love me some good smelling scents peach prosecco macaron is another one that I actually showed on my shorts I I love this packaging number one number two the scent is absolutely amazing it's just such a fun peach scent I love fruity scents. I really do. I like smelling citrusy. I like smelling like a peach. You guys know peach bellini is like my absolute favorite scent. This one comes very, very close. It smells like peaches and just a lot of sugar. Um, it has peach prosecco, vanilla cream, and macaron cookie. It just, it smells so good. It smells like a dessert. It is literally what it smells like. I, I love it. I give this one easy nine out of ten this one is raspberry tangerine now i'm very very close to the bottom of this one so i'm just gonna count it in my empties but this scent so freaking good like it's it literally smells just like the name raspberries and tangerines very citrusy very fruity um i like keeping like the small pocket bags in my car just for when i'm pumping gas or when i'm getting in from work or grocery shopping whatever i'm doing I don't know what it is, but I always have like such sticky hands. Like when I leave, especially like a grocery store, it's uh, gross. So I like having these on hand so I can I can smell good throughout the day. But I would give this one also a solid 9 out of 10. Now the rest of what I used up are all wallflowers. The first one is Market Peach and Strawberry Pound Cake. Y'all, this one is so strong. This scent, I will say, is not for everyone. It is really, really, really strong. Um, but it smells super, super good, in my opinion. It has um, Juicy Peaches, Golden Shortcake, and Whipped Cream. So it literally smells just like what it's called. So a strawberry shortcake with peaches in it. It's And the um, packaging is super, super fun. I give this one, for me, it was probably like an 8 out of 10. Just because of, there are days where it's kind of overpowering. You don't want to put this one in a room that you're going to be in all the time. The scent lingers throughout the entire house. So it's very potent. I love that. I actually like um, how some of these scents smell as they're kind of like diffusing into other areas. But the room that it's physically in, it's going to be very, very strong. And some people don't like that. Some people do. Um, I definitely recommend if you have any of those wallflowers where you can change like the intensity, definitely get one of those if you're going to use this set. But it still smells so freaking good. I tried out another new one. Um, it's Champagne Toast and Fresh Orange. Now, a lot of these I picked up during the semi-annual sale, which one of the things I love about it is just you find so many different scents that you never knew existed this one has bubbly champagne sparkling berries and a fresh orange i give this one probably a 8 out of 10 as well to me it smells more like oranges than anything else and i think that's what i love the most about it i just love my citrusy scents yeah it's like very very lemon um and orange that's more than the champagne part L let me know if you guys know what champagne is supposed to smell like because I don't know. I just know it tastes good. Next is strawberry daiquiri. I love strawberry daiquiri. I have a candle in this one as well. I think I have a couple others of the wallflowers. It literally smells like the drink. It just smells so good to me. It has frozen strawberries, sweet simple syrup, shot of tropical rum, and zesty citrus twist. Y'all have to try the scent. I'm giving this a solid 10 out of 10. I just, I don't know what it is, but this scent literally makes me so freaking happy. Um, promise i'm not an alcoholic but like it's just so good it's so fruity i think it's strawberry scents are growing on me a lot more um strawberry and peach i think those are my top two but this one it just smells like it says fruity and happy that's literally what it is 10 out of 10 you guys have to have to try it, it smells like the real deal i also used up a wakiki beach coconut this one smells like the beach literally that's to a t what it smells like so this is also from their fruity and happy line it has tropical white coconut salt water breezes sun bleached woods it smells so freaking good i don't know what it is guys i'm like it's like fiji white sands with a little bit more coconut in it 
oh yeah oh yeah this is like an eight and a half out of ten for me i've been loving coconut scents as i've get, gotten older like it's just it reminds me of my happy place and definitely as i've gotten older i haven't been able to go to my happy place as often as that's the beach so the more I have the scents around me, honestly, the happier I am. <laughs> Last but not least, you guys, I used up a saltwater breeze. Now, saltwater breeze to me was almost like a masculine scent, if I'm not mistaken. It's from their Fresh and Relaxing line. It has fresh linen, violet waves, water blossom, and white musk. And I think it's the white musk that makes it a little more uh, masculine. Oh, yeah, for sure. It's kind of like a manly-ish cologne, but like in a very subtle way. So, like, imagine you're at the beach with a good-smelling guy. That's the way that I think of it. Ooh. Wait, oh, this smells good. I like this one, too. I give this one, like, a solid 8.5, 9 out of 10. But I'm just, like, having all these next to me, like, it just makes me so happy because I've really been trying to enjoy all my products more often and not just using them up just to use them up. I feel like that's such a waste of money, but I've found so many scents that I'm absolutely in love with that I wouldn't have even tried honestly so if you guys aren't on top of it try out the semi-annual sales I promise you'll find at least one or two items that like you'll fall in love with but anyways you guys that is it for my empties video it was very short very simple um but I loved it and I hope you guys loved it too as always my loves I hope you guys have an amazing day and even better tomorrow and I'll see you in my next one Bye guys.